object now. I'm sorry, we have a raster object now. But it turns out I can add that raster object to a vector item. And when I do so, I get a cute sphere. And at this point is when the fireworks start going off. Because now I can extrude, I can scale, I can extrude again, I can scale, or I can extrude uh, by going out like this, I can extrude again. Now you see that that's where all the action comes to. Yeah, I will. <laughs> I will. <laughs> I will. The thing is, is that this is like walking into a forest. The first time you walk into the forest, you love all the trees. It's a wonderful experience. It's interesting. But do you know the ecosystem of the forest? Do you know what that bird does? Do you know what that squirrel does? Do you know where the nuts are? Do you know where the mushrooms are? A real expert could go in and live in the forest. They would never have to buy anything from the grocery store. They could set traps and bake things and do it. They could do that. A real expert. I can't do that because I don't know the forest. Guess what? I know this forest. All right? Now, you're going to see me do it again and again because the more times you walk into the forest, the more things you observe. And what I typically do is I walk in once and then I do it again. But I change just a little bit. I do it again. I change this a little bit more. I change it. So all of a sudden now you start to see more dimensions in the forest. All right. Let's go back to the original thing. Because I did a lot of stuff. Not only did I start pushing and pulling and all this stuff, the very first thing I did, if you notice, is I used this tool. And this tool is selection. It's like Photoshop or like Illustrator. I can choose this button. And up the other, I did two things. I selected things, and then I also changed things that I was selecting. We might call these buttons right here the anatomy of the object. The reason I call it anatomy is, look, I got an anatomy, a head, this, and that. that's what I'm made up of. Skin, bone, blood, veins, nerves, fascia, that's what I'm made up of. This is not so sophisticated. It's made up of geometry. And the geometry are, are object, the axes of the object, every object has an axis in the world, the points of the object, the lines of the object, the faces of the object, and these have some other qualities, right? Now, can you see my finger when I got it in here? Yes. All right, good. All right, now, so this is beautiful, because now you know that you have one, two, three, four, five, five different ways to interact with that object. You can interact with it as an object, 